Okay, go, go ahead and, and, and tell me what we're seeing here. This is the gymnasium and the first, second, third grades. And I think possibly the kindergarten was back in this area too. Uh, I believe that's where they found the first victims come out of that building right there. And that's where your wife was? Yes. Okay, and she teaches? Second grade. Okay. And she had kids down on the floor in front of her, and they were bent over in the hallway, and the hallway door slung open, and then the vacuum lifted the roof, and then the debris started flying through, and she claims that she saw one of the brick walls collapse over on some kids. You said that... Uh... The, the, they like the the ceiling opened above them. Yeah, the the door slung open first, and then the vacuum came through, and then it li lifted the roof, and everything started crashing in on them. This was the hallway that takes you out to the playground. You got this class, this class, and another class. This is the classroom. Four classes on each side. Eight classrooms. You can see the Charlie Brown and Lucy still up on the wall over there. And they pretty much cleared the desk, but there was desks set up right through there. It still had their books and everything laid out for their classwork that they were doing. Uh, her desk was over in that corner. My wife's car was parked down here in this parking lot on the west end of the school. Now it's about two and a half blocks down here on the other side of the street over there, up against a tree. This thing was moving about 60 miles an hour, what they were saying when it came through here. So there wasn't a whole lot of time to get undercover, you know.